Welcome to the Jerry Grant channel. This is Channel Toss It About Narcissists. I want to go ahead and jump straight into the topic. But first, make sure you leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. Let's jump into it. All right, so my last video, I said I didn't want to go into specific examples, but I can't help it. You know, I want to talk about some specific examples of my mom hating on me. Um, so for one, if I ever tell her something's going on in my life, like, oh, she'll always be like, I'm sure it'll work out for you. It always does. Like she says it with an, with a, an evil attitude, you know, like she doesn't want shit to work out for me, you know, and it's obvious and it's like some hater saboteur type of stuff. But when it came to the ladies, when it came to the women, there's one situation that stuck out. And I don't even know if I really want to go too deep into it. But basically, like, there's this girl that was, like, she was the hottest girl in my school. Or at least, like, she was top two, bro. And now I'm talking about high school. She was a senior. I was a, a freshman. And she was checking for me. You know what I'm saying? She was checking for me. She liked me. And my mom hated that because that type of stuff doesn't normally happen. You know what I'm saying? That doesn't happen. So she's almost, she's jealous. And I can, sometimes I hear her talking about stuff like that. Like, why does it always ha work? Like, why does stuff work always work out for him? Or, you know what I'm saying? Like, she, she says stuff like that. So she's calling the girl a pedophile. You know, and it wasn't, she, the girl, she wasn't a pedophile. She just was checking for me, bro. It, it just happens sometimes. It, so anyway, the next story, my mom's dragging me over. I didn't really, I hated going over to her friend's house just because I didn't feel like I, her, her friend, she felt, I felt like she was, my mom was ta hating on me before, while I'm not there. So their, my whole attitude towards her, her friend and her daughters, like I didn't like them because I felt like I could feel the judgment the moment I first came around them. You know what I'm saying? They came to my house one day and I could just feel the way they were looking at me. Like some, my mom had been hating on me. And, and so their daughters are my age. So I guess they invite me over, you know what I'm saying, every once in a while. So I end up over there, and they were having some type of party or something. I don't know what, what the deal was. They just had a friend over, and that her, the friend of the girls ended up liking me or something. I don't know. but And she was like a real cute girl. So my mom comes to me afterwards, like days and later, like weeks later, talking about how she told that girl when she found out because they told her. I'm like, why are you telling me? Tell me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> why are you telling my mom what's going on? They're doing that girl stuff where they're, they're doing that. And then so they tell her and then she tells the girl, well, me and her – he doesn't even get along with his mom. Like, why are you? I wouldn't even like him if I was you. No, like he he can't even get along with his mom. Like saying stuff like that, like stupid, weird shit, stuff. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, why would you say that, bro? She tells my mom came and told me she said that. And her general attitude about a girl liking me was jealousy. It, and there was times where I brought girls over and she'd be like unfriendly. There was times where I would do something well that doesn't have nothing to do with girls, like score high on that, the ASVAB. And she'd be like, well, I don't believe you scored high. I don't believe you. Or, you know, just hating, just hating. I'm like, you're an idiot. <laughs> Oh my God, man, my mom's an idiot, bro. But yeah, there's no, there's no good side of that. It's just, 
that's just kind of what you got to deal with sometimes. There's people out here that shouldn't be hating that hate. And it's weird. Sometimes stuff is working for me. And then sometimes they're hating when it's not even, things ain't really going that well. But her her whole general attitude is just, she's just a hater. And I, I don't know why, but she just, I guess because she's a narcissist. And the funny thing about this is my mom found this channel too. And she was trying to tell me that she's not a narcissist. I'm like, uh, I think I, I think I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> So, long story short, it is what it is, you know, people throwing salt in the game, and it's, the thing is, is there's already, already so many things against you that you shouldn't have to have the extra people throwing, you know, going against you, like, people that have nothing to do with nothing, like, you're not gonna get her, mom, like, you don't have to date her. Like, you don't, you know what I mean? You don't have to do, you're not going to get anything out of throwing salt. All you can do, like, just feeling good that you ruined something that could have been, I guess. Losers. But that's, that's some examples of what a narcissistic mom is like. Jealousy. Jealous that you're, oh, that you're younger than her. You know, jealous of things going well in your life, just overall, just a general level of jealousy. And that's all I got. Peace. Oh yeah. And, and that girl was not a pedophile.